Hey everyone, welcome to this psychology lecture series. In this video, we are going to talk about Sigmund Freud. Sigmund Freud was born on 6 May 1856 in Austria and died on 23rd September 1939 in United Kingdom. Sigmund Freud was the founding father of psychoanalysis. Psychoanalysis is a method for treating mental illness and also a theory which explains human behavior. Initially, Sigmund Freud completed his medical degree and in 1886, he opened a medical practice specializing in neurology. Sigmund Freud's work and theories helped shape our views of childhood, personality, memory, sexuality and therapy. Some of the words that we use in our day-to-day -day life that were coined by Sigmund Freud are Freudian slip, repression and denial. One of his most interesting concepts is about the unconscious mind which he describes as a reservoir of thoughts, memories and emotions that lie outside the awareness of the conscious mind. Some of his famous theories are life and death instincts, the theory of psychosexual development and the mechanisms of defense. We have already discussed about these theories in my previous video, Psychoanalytical School of Thought. Some of Freud's patients who helped shape his theories are Anna O, Little Hans, Dora, Ratman and Ulfman. Some of the psychologists influenced by Freud are his own daughter Anna Freud, Alfred Adler, Carl Hung, Eric Erickson, Melanie Klein, Ernst Jones and Otto Rank. Some of the major works of Sigmund Freud are The Interpretation of Dreams in 1900, The Psychopathology of Everyday Life in 1904, Three Essays on the Theory of Sexuality in 1905, Civilization and its Discontents in 1930. In the next video, let's talk about William James. I hope you like this video. Please share these videos with everyone who is preparing for this exam. Thank you.